Mickey's Warehouse. So without further ado, let's get this party started. Now, this first one, I want to say it's a little controversial. It may actually not be. And I try to put logic towards it. Why is my wife over there just making as much noise as she possibly can? Hey, hello. Hey. Thank you. Jeez. Anyway, that story is a little controversial, but it may be controversial because I'm trying to make it controversial and it may not, but giving my ex-wife a lot of money. So I recently won a large amount of money, like half you money. I won't say exactly how much it is, but it's in the millions. Now, my ex-wife is the mother of my two kids. She's an amazing woman and she's good to the bone. We divorced six years ago because I had an affair with my current partner. I was in a low place in my life and I really messed up. My wife was in incredible pain, but like a saint, she allowed me to still see our kids who mean the world to me. She allowed our divorce to be as pain-free as possible despite the fact that I knew she was hurting. My wife is also still close with my parents. She's really respectful to me, although she refuses to talk to my girlfriend. She was actually the first person I phoned, after my mom and dad, when I found out I won the lottery. She was really happy for me. She joked that I could take the kids on a world trip, and that was that. Nothing else. She didn't ask for money. Nothing. Now, as soon as I won, I knew I wanted to give her a significant amount, as I still love her. She's the mother of my babies, and I feel this is some tiny way that I can show her that I'm not a complete screw-up. She deserves to know I care, despite my mistakes. My wife also works a crappy job in the public library, which pays her peanuts. She would actually be able to pursue her hobbies this way. It would also help give our kids a better life between us. So long story short, when I told my girlfriend, she was livid. My girlfriend screamed that by giving my ex-wife money that I'm disrespecting her, that I don't owe my ex-wife a single dime. She even accused me of still being in love with my ex-wife. Now I do love my ex-wife, but I'm not in love with her. We've both grown apart, but of course I still love her for being an excellent co-parenting partner and a mother to my kids. My girlfriend is threatening to break up with me if I give my ex even a cent. And to be honest, I'm feeling incredibly relieved over the threats. I don't plan on changing my plans. Am I wrong for doing that? I'll let you go first. This is real simple for me. She's a girlfriend. The hell, she, I don't give a damn what she wants. She can go. Bye. Hell, this is my money. This ain't your money no way. You a girlfriend. Trade you out like you trade out socks. Talking about. Now, and, and yeah, keep, this in mind, keep this in mind, Theus. That's the girlfriend he cheated on the wife with. I don't even care. Doesn't matter. Could be, could, yeah, they got that kind of jacked up history, but that's on him. That's not on her. You know, I mean, even if she knew about the wife, which is bad. He is the one who cheated on his ex-wife. So that's on him. I'm just saying she she ain't got enough rank for this. You know what I'm saying? Like you, 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 you ain't got no rank, Shorty. You, you, come on, man. You a girlfriend. Get the hell on. You ain't breaking up with me because you know I won the lottery anyway. So now nah, you trying to play the card to get married so you could become the next ex-wife. Kiss my ass. Now. As far as like the ex-wife, I ain't gonna lie, man. I mean, I'm married, love my wife to death. We've been married for oh, shit, I don't know, 16 years now. Um, I'd still break my ex-wife off some money, and we don't even have a child that's underage no more. Because she was a great partner in raising our daughter. She's a good friend, and she ain't gonna get much, but you know what I'm saying? I make sure the people that are close to me are taken care of like that, you know? So my wife might, you know, pull some rank there, but unless I'm talking stupid dumb money, which I wouldn't, you know, I seriously doubt she'd have much of an issue. 
Now, she could still push back, though. And I mean, we just have to work that out. And maybe shit don't go nowhere. And then money goes to my daughter. And then she do what the fuck she want to do with it. You know, take care of your mama that way. <laughs> but, you and, know. And, and that's what kind of bothers me is. Dude wants to do good by the wife because, in all honesty, she could have just blew this whole thing up. You, dude, you was the one that cheated. She could have been an a-hole during the divorce. She could have made your life miserable with the kids. She could have did a whole bunch of stuff. She took the high ground. She didn't do none of that stuff. Y'all are great co-parenting. Go about what you were saying. She still, you know, we cool with everything. And the funny thing about it is you, you, you have a little something going, something in you with the wife. Now, you say you ain't in love with her. Because the first person he called was her. Not the after he called his parents. The, no, he said. I, first, I, he said first person I called after my parents was okay. my was my ex wife. Not the girl. You know what I'm saying? But that's because that's how close they are. Because his girlfriend was probably right there anyway. Uh, a nosy ass. But anyway, <laughs> <laughs> but my my thing is like this, man. Look, because I guess he probably look at it like I look at it, right? Okay, I have how much money right now? Okay. And then I just got, you know what I'm saying, fuck you money. I ain't had none of that money before. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, if I went from, you know, a couple thou to all of a sudden I got 500 mil, that's all make believe money, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't, it ain't like I had it three days ago. So if there's a time to not be selfish, it's up front. And you look at the people who has done me right, who's been there for me when everything was fucked up. And that, that's going to be, in his case, his parents, his ex-wife. And I don't know who else he might have in the circle. Maybe he got a sibling or two. I don't know. But that's how he was, that's how he was running the mat. You know what I'm saying? And then you got this selfish ass, you know what I'm saying, you know, I don't know, you know baby catcher or whatever the fuck you want to call herself, sitting here talking about what you're going to do with your money. And you can't tell me what to do on money. You can't tell me to do what what to do with a coupon. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? My so, issue is right there. And I tried to keep my cool about it, but okay, they just had to bring it out of me. You can't tell me what I can do with my money. That's just not gonna happen. My it's, wife can try. My yeah. wife can. You ain't a wife. <laughs> you you ain't. You ain't a wife. Mm -mm. You a girlfriend. You the home wrecker. And you no, she ain't a home wrecker. She was. She was a home wrecker. No, no. home wrecker. He had to decide where to dip his pen. He made, That's a, he made a final decision, but final decision. Hell, I said he had. To she make made the final decision. He made all the decisions up to the final decision. Wait a minute, who the wife? Oh, that the know. girlfriend. The girlfriend made the final decision, meaning that it's her body. She gets to decide who she interacts with. But everything up to that point, that's on him. Okay. Well, paying her any attention, courting her, flirting, do sneaking and doing shit she ain't got no business doing, all on him. Okay. Well, you ain't making this decision. You still Not a girlfriend. Her. You, you, you're, she probably can't even figure out where the hell they're eating dinner. How the hell is she gonna tell me what to do with some money? Your, your, your decision making is over with. Now, for for the ex wife, yeah. I mean, I don't have an ex. I don't have an ex wife. It would be me and Kim if I, I, if I ever had an ex wife. And I guarantee, you I probably will still break Kim off a little something. Whatever the reason is that we broke up, I, I, I just can't see myself just rolling and. I, she's still struggling or whatever. Well, that's where we differ. Because there's some reasons why my fuck you money will have me also saying fuck you, honey. So <laughs> It depends um, on what the reason is. Yeah. yeah you know okay. what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. We okay. irreconcilable differences. We grew apart. Marriage failed. Whatever. Hey, I got you. You got me. When I had nothing, you were there. You had my back. 
when I was building, we were building together. We were suffering together. We were joyful together. We did all that shit. It didn't work out. All right, cool. I'm going to make sure you're not broke, right? You know what I'm saying? I don't even care if I, if I, made, if I got a 500 mil and then I dropped you two mil because, yes, I ain't, gonna, I ain't giving you what I got. I'm, I drop you two mil. I don't care if you take that two mil and go shack up with some dude in 48 hours. I could care less. I gave you the money. That's your money. Done. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But me, I'm going to be in another country uh, living a good life. My kids will have passports and, and easy travel. Okay. Tracy said girlfriend needs to sit all the way down. Yep. Mickey said. But I bet you she ain't breaking up. I bet oh. she ain't breaking up. Look. Okay. Go ahead and leave. And see how many people call She ain't me. going nowhere. She ain't going nowhere. As long as he can take care of business at home, the girlfriend should have no say say in how he spends the money and it will help out with his children. And that's another thing. It, this woman is greedy. Let's let's put it this. The girlfriend is so greedy because all she really uh, wants selfish. All, greedy and selfish. She wants the money. She wants all the money. She don't want none of the money going to nobody else but her. And them. So, well, her. See, I don't think that she's... I, that's why I said I don't think she's greedy because a lot of people who are like that, they, she hadn't even got to the stage of greed yet. You know what I'm saying? At this point, it's just a matter of the money is a reflection of your affection for someone else. And that's where she's like, no. You want to give money to your parents? Do that. You want to give money to your brother? Do that. Oh, you want to give money to the woman that was before me? Mm. I'm like, I ain't even buying you a bus ticket or Uber. You better, you better go on out of here. Just, just... <laughs> but you said she ain't going nowhere. Really she ain't, know. but I am. Shoot. First, shoot. I can get, hey, I can get past her first reaction. Like her first reaction when I bring it to her. And, you know, because she's human, right? You know, what you talking about? Blah, 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 blah. And I'll be like, oh, this is what I'm doing. So, you, you, what? You, you, you saying, you, first of all, any girlfriend I've ever had has always known, you don't threaten me. It's a bad move. It's a bad move. So, you tell me you leaving, that, you, may just, you just made a commitment. Right? <laughs> it's not like we had a fight and you're like, I'm gonna leave. No, you, you said that shit. We done. We we good. You. I would literally lie. I would literally lie and say I already gave her the money. Just to see. see I wouldn't even. I wouldn't even have to do it. I, I feel you though. No, that, that way you can go ahead and hurry her up on her decision. Just yeah. I want you. What I'm saying is, the fact she made the threat, she already made the decision. I'm just gonna hold. I'm just gonna hold her to it. Don't threaten so the threat was if you give her the money, I'm going to leave. So, so you gave me a threat. So, so you gave me a threat. I already, I already gave her the money. I wouldn't even go that far. We're done right now. Right, we was done anyway. I just wanted to see. I don't need that. to tell you that I gave her nothing. I, 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 we're done anyway. I mean, yeah, I'm, I don't like man, threat, please. But... Yep. I done dump people for eating with their mouth open. You know I'm a dump you for doing some dumb <laughs> shit like that. Come on now. What's wrong with you? Yikes. We are so moving on. 